An American reporter for the Wall Street Journal has been arrested in Russia. He's been accused of spying and he is facing 20 years in prison. Our D.C. Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy is live at the White House following it all for us. Ben. Calvin, Nicole, the White House calls those charges you were talking about ridiculous. Russia says not true, but they have stopped short of providing any kind of proof of their claims. We condemn the detention of Mr. Gerskovich. The White House condemning Russia's move to detain an American journalist, accusing Evan Gerskovich of spying, alleging the 31-year-old was gathering Russian military secrets. The Wall Street Journal denies the allegations from the FSB and seeks the immediate release of our trusted and dedicated reporter. There's no reason to believe that those charges are accurate, the espionage uh, are accurate. The Biden administration released a statement that the targeting of American citizens by the Russian government is unacceptable as Gershkovitz is the first U.S. correspondent put behind bars for spying accusations since the Cold War. We have seen the Russian government's escalating uh, repression uh, against journalists and to civil society voices uh, and the broader Russian community for quite some time. The arrest takes place amid heightened tensions between Russia and the U.S. <laughs> On Wednesday, the Kremlin announced it's refusing to give advance warnings to America about its missile tests. It had comes one month after the Russian parliament voted to suspend the New START treaty a nuclear agreement that caps the number of warheads and allows inspections of nuclear bases. Big mistake. A mistake the U.S. and its allies hope Russia reconsiders as they now work to secure the release of an American journalist. Uh, I think Joe Biden has shown that he's not someone who's going to be toyed with when it comes to these sort of things. And so, yes, uh, for his family's sake, uh, he should be uh, released. The State Department continues to tell Americans not to travel to Russia and for U.S. citizens in Russia right now to depart immediately. Reporting live at the White House, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News. Okay, ben.